515 October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month and while many of the efforts are focused on women's breast cancer, it's important to remember that men too can get the disease. While cases among men are much less common than women, men have lower survival rates. It's a rare but potentially deadly diagnosis in men breast cancer. Last month, Minnesota resident Randy Clouck became one of the estimated 2,500 men in the U.S. who will be diagnosed this year. Why did I get it? I have no cancer history in my family, and yet I'm diagnosed with cancer. It makes no sense, but yet it can happen. Male breast cancer makes up about 1% of all cases. Patients are often older and in more advanced stages of the disease. Men don't like to go see doctors anyway. They don't take as good care of themselves as women do. But if a man has a, feels a lump or has a discharge or has any bleeding from the nipple, they need to get checked. Treatment options are also under-researched. For example, men are often excluded from clinical trials of new drugs. A recent analysis by the Mayo Clinic of more than 10,000 patients found a quarter underwent breast conserving surgery. Of that group, 70% went on to receive radiation treatment. Overall, about half of the entire study group got chemotherapy. But I shake your hand. Beyonce's father, Matthew Knowles, recently revealed he had a mastectomy, speaking out to raise awareness and offer support to other men like Randy Clouck. I will never be cancer free. Now pushing for better research and understanding.